right, guys. They're playing Zin Zhao Ta plane. We're playing Zin Zhao today versus Akali. And for the runes, we're running Lethal Tempo, Triumph, Alacrity, Lascent, Biscuit Delivery, and then also Cosmic Inside. This game, we're going to have a lot of fun with the uh, the build from Season 14. Don't know if you guys have seen the other Zin Zhao video that I made, but like, Zin Zhao is looking so good at the moment. Like again, I actually talked about it last time, but like season 13 was awesome. Season 14, since now, is like much better in my opinion. Many more options to choose from with the builds. You have a lot of solid matchups out there. Let's see if we can get that. All right. Not tanking a colleague use. I'd like to 1v1 her straight away level 1, but she's keeping a distance where she could potentially hit uh, Q on me. All right, you come out. <laughs> I also take that one, sure. All right, no problem. So the thing about Akali is like, as soon as she, as soon as you go in, she's always gonna drop the shroud down. Once that shroud goes down and it's going on the cooldown, you can go back in and actually win the 1v1. That's basic, uh, basically how you win the, the lane against this guy. We'll get level three soon. Oh, she got to level 3 now. Hmm. She doesn't go for the jump. Okay. She doesn't have the shroud at the moment. <laughs> Alright, not bad. She doesn't go for the jump. No. If she went for E, then I would actually end up winning that stuff. Nice. Okay. Yeah, let's get back here. So, for the build, I actually want to go for a little bit of a different build this time. So, what I'm actually thinking of is going for Eclipse and then specifically going either into Trinity or going into Titanic Hydra. But either way, eventually, I want to be able to get, like, both. So... I'm thinking like Eclipse would be really nice, then going into Trinity Force. Or we can just go Eclipse straight away into Titanic Hydra. Because like Titanic Hydra fits as an auto attack reset, so if you go in and you pop your auto Q, you can actually also apply the Titanic Hydra inside of the combo. Nice, I'll walk away from this one. I might go for an all in, I'm gonna put some points in E here. Oh, well played. Well played right there. Not bad. She'll probably TP back. Good chance. We're putting some points in my E because E is just like instant damage. Okay, let's hold it. She will teleport back. Eventually. If she doesn't teleport, she will lose the full wave. Nice. Yeah, she's not teleporting, so that's a that's a win for me here. That's gonna like expand my lead a lot. She should be back any second now, so I'm gonna drop like a few autos here to thin out the wave a little bit. She will come back with more items than me though. So it's gonna be a bit of a challenge. She has boots. Okay. No shroud. Okay. No shroud for Omakali here. Hmm. Okay, still going in. Ah, she's scouting me down. Goodbye, I win. So basically, that's where I have the advantage because since our straight up has better all in than Akali does, if she gets through her shroud. So as soon as the shroud goes on cooldown, it's basically a win for me. Because then I just re-engage with the little tempo, and I shouldn't be able to lose. Nah, I can't stop the freeze. Unfortunately, she will kill me if I go in. Kind of forced like back out here. Let's go for that one. And let's get back. Alright. 
So currently we have a pickaxe longsword versus a uh, pretty much amplifying tome and tier one boots. So she has more movement speed than me. She can basically kite me down slightly better. Again, if I get that shroud down, I can basically do the same strat. The, the thing is now like Akali can get into shroud, hit the combo, hit the hit her ultimate, and then she can kill me instant. That's the that's where the difference is at currently. So we gotta be very smart with how we trade this guy right now. Just be tr I'll try to be unpredictable. Okay. We're getting her slightly low. Let's see if I can thin out the wave just a little bit. Okay, this is where things get challenging because the wave is starting to stack up now. I'll have to thin this out a little bit. Alright. More points in my E right here for level 7. She's level 6. I win. Oh. I just uh, comboed the wave. Amazing. Terrible. The warrior spirit is never broken. <laughs> I just like dropped like two things down on the wave. Very bad. She's level 7 now too. But the difference is that... I'm, am I getting ganked here? The way how this guy moves up to me, man. Mm -hmm. Okay. She moved up to me like Jarvin was ganking my lane. Turns out, Jarvin's bot lane, not top lane. Okay. I'll, dra I'll drag the wave. I'll tank it up and then walk in here. Oh, there's a ward. Never mind, I suppose. Yep, there's the shroud. I win. Too bad for you, buddy. Nice. And we're also getting the a part of the tower. I'll just shove this out. We have the time needed to do this. Nice. All right, let's go back here. Nice. So we have Eclipse at 8 minutes. 8 minutes 55 in the game. Nice. Great. So my combo is going to be amazing now. Because uh, basically we can uh, we can jump in without my W. I'll just like jump in with my E directly. So she doesn't expect it. Then I hit the auto Q. Which procs Eclipse for the shield. And when she procs the shroud. I'll fall back. Re-engage with the little tempo in my next E. And that should turn into a kill. Like, if she doesn't hit R, right? So now, if I go in, my shield will always tank the damage. So, my, my, my uh, traits are going to be super clean right now. They're going to be amazing. There you go. Basically hit it. Now we re-engage. And there it is. Hmm. Oh, I still got like one. Maybe. I think that my jungler has probably has a free kill. Probably. A good chance. Okay, he doesn't get to hold it. Yeah, he's gonna end up dying. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was worth trying, I suppose. Alright, let's make it back. Tough one. I actually killed Akali. But the thing is, with Akali, she was not really worth as much. So I killed her, but we basically got nothing out of Akali. Alright. So I think what we're going to do next is we're just going to be building into Titanic Hydra. I also really want Trinity Force. I really want Trinity Force. Like, that item is such a good combo. Mm. Wait a second. Try and do, like, a similar combo, like before. Alright, oh, yeah, Jarvan's top lane. There you go.
Wait a second. I definitely can't approach a Kali there. There's not a chance. Okay. Two of them. Good. And the shutdown goes to the jungle. So my jungle, uh, jungler can snowball the game now. Nice. They get plates too. She'll probably teleport. If it's up. Nice. Ooh, thankfully she doesn't go for it. Cool. This is way up here. Hmm. We could maybe, maybe we can go for another because we have actually Kane like right on the back here. So it's maybe possible. The thing is, I don't have any anything up. I have no ult, no ignite. I guess we can dive. It's definitely a play where we can dive. For sure. And we got a plate. Amazing. Yeah, Kali's still top lane. Uh, my jungler definitely wins that, no, no doubt. Okay. That's a good time to be careful. Just a little. Yep. And tower's ours. Good. We have like 2.3. The thing is I can't shove any more than this. Because if I do. We could actually be ganked by Jarvan. Okay Jarvan shows. Alright. Let's go into Trinity. Uh, we'll go for that one. Actually, eh, I'll swap that around. There you go. Yeah, that's slightly better. I just want to have the Arbound next because this one provides uh, damage, attack speed. And I also want to have Sheen because I'm actually going in, dropping my combo. I can actually proc my Sheen twice if I do it correctly. There will be a fight. I'm on my way. I missed my combo. <laughs> Terrible. <laughs> oh man, like that was so troll. That was so bad. <laughs> I just wanted to get that kill so badly, bro. Perhaps maybe. Still got ult. Alright. Ah, oh, this is another kill. Sure. <laughs> this could maybe be even uh, one for... F yeah, okay. That's why they make us down too. Nice. We got Trinity already. Very, very, very nice. Meanwhile in bot lane. Also, by the way, worth noting, we actually do not have a support this game because our support has left the game. Hopefully we'll come back. But so far the game looks winnable for against five. Alright, let's go. Yeah, we're gonna run top. This game looks very winnable for against five, man. We'll see how far we can make it. John was going for that one. It's very likely they're going to be moving top lane. Oh, sure. We'll take that. Pick up my jump across. Maybe a Kali will show. What? Good. Well, this guy's dead. 
cannot believe they're not getting a single one of these. Yeah, that's like one at least. Uh, seems like several people are down here. Got around for life. <laughs> Better not mess with the Akali right now. We need to be getting the Titanic Hydra soon. Don't have that much mana? Oh, there's like a guy right behind him. Sure. Nice. Uh, we're just gonna go into specifically Berserker's Greaves just so I can get the attack speed. And um, afterwards, we're definitely going into team map for Titanic Hydra. That item is probably going to change the game. We already have the core build, we ju we're just missing Titanic Hydra. Wait, don't wanna lose too much of that wave. I would have loved going top lane, but I do think we can actually get a free kill right here. Hmm. I'll rotate wherever they go because I can kill anyone at the moment. I can 1v1 everybody of that team. You can, you can just go in. Nice, good catch. Amazing. Again, like we just win every fight. She'll probably go this way. Oh, I didn't see that. So apparently she walked out. That's a bit too much. You don't get to win this. Okay. Yeah, I actually didn't hit that one. Okay. Another one. I think we could maybe jump to Smolder if, if he just gets inside a range. Oh. 1.6k. Yeah, let's get my team out. Pretty tough game, man. We don't have support this game. Our support has never came back in the game. Disconnected almost 10 minutes ago. Roughly. Tough one. But yeah, still, like, as you can see, it's perfectly winnable. We just need Cho'Gat to scale. Cho'Gat is, like, uh, pretty weak in a game like this at the start, but becomes OP later on in the game. I definitely don't think we're catching back. Oh, on this. Okay. Nice. Not bad. That's probably a... What? <laughs> He's such a random ghost, man. <laughs> what does that mean? Let me quickly force the tower before it goes down. Could definitely get another one. Uh, not in range, unfortunately. Oh, well, we are actually. Another catch. Again, Jarvan, is, Jarvan just doesn't get to do that much. Ooh, I nearly hit that one too. Alright, time to get Dragon. I'm excited, man. Like, the second that we make it to Titanic Hydra in some kind of way. We're gonna be having a good time, trust me.
Where are you going? That's nice Trey. Jarvan is not helping you today, my man. I think Kane could maybe get it. Maybe. Hmm. I have way too much gold currently. I need to go back. Too much. Far too much. We're going to be hitting... Um, the, the most fun item in my opinion so far soon. We're going to go into Sundered Sky, which is going to make us more tanky, but also provide the crit auto. Actually, support's coming back. Ah, ah, ah. <laughs> yeah. Our support has come, came back. Oh, now my Cho get disconnects. <laughs> Now we have two people disconnected. <laughs> you can't be serious. My support is still AFK and now Choka joins the... Oh, <laughs> I cannot believe that, man. I'm not allowed to win the game. <laughs> not a chance, man. Alright. Ooh, this could be one. Well, I just kind of, uh, kind of trolled it. We actually didn't catch the flag. Never mind, I suppose. We actually did get her in the end. Okay. Guess I'm gonna go for that one, because... I don't get to 1v3. That stuff in mid lane. On my way. Sundered Sky it is, pretty much. Let me sell that one. Well, my teammates are back. My, my support is playing the match. And uh, Cho is back, so no more DCs. They're back in the game. Alright. Wait a second. Okay. Yeah, I'm definitely not jumping in just yet. Well, yeah, I've, I'm definitely flashing backwards, not going back in. Ooh, I've nearly managed to hit that one. Oh, yeah, my teammates just didn't know I was going back in. Ah, oh, man. <laughs> no. Yeah, my teammates didn't know I was going back in, so. <laughs> Alright. Tough one. At the end of the day, might still lose the game. I, I certainly don't blame it on the performance this game. We had two people AFK in standing in base for the longest time. I think that is still winnable. Because they get to defend the game. Look, Joe gets also scaling. He's look, look at how strong this guy is at the moment. Look at that stuff. <clears throat> By the way, definitely worth noting, this is not the regular Cho the, that we're seeing at the moment. This guy is actually going AP Cho. So he looks very tanky, but he's not that tanky. That's the only problem we have. Let's see if we can get that dragon. 
Probably not, because we're far too late for this. It's very unlikely. Maybe you can steal it somehow. Okay, we got like one catch. Good. Amazing. I actually missed out one. Unbelievable. Yeah, that's gonna... Uh, Alright, the game's probably over. Probably is. If Smolder dies first, maybe. Okay. <laughs> well, we got pretty far. Remember, man, we had two people AFK. Two people left the game. <laughs> Remember that, man. This was close. <laughs> Good turn easily. But yeah, anyway, this is Sinsa Top. Thanks so much for watching. See you the video. And I'll see you guys next time. Peace.